We have developed technologies currently right now in more than 10 African countries. In South Africa, we have an air quality monitoring device. We developed a prototype. The government is currently scaling that across the country to measure air quality, measure the correlation between that and respiratory diseases. In Cameroon, we have developed a vector borne disease surveillance system that's currently being adopted by the government. In Ghana, we have done some for dengue and Zika co-infection as well as malaria. We have built a data portal for this disease, vector borne disease. We work with National Malaria Control Program and they are using this and we have built an earlier warning system for them. In Ethiopia, we're looking at polio, which is always very difficult before they discover it. Somebody's already paralyzed. We have gone on and we have actually built the first data portal that have all the data images. And we have trained a model that's now able to detect very early on when you take an image. And we have handed this to non-governmental organizations that we work with and the government has adopted this. Making data actionable is our key. When I talk about the prototypes that we have developed with our air quality monitoring device, we have 100 currently deployed. We're trying to scale that up across the country. So in the next future, working with data and policy, our hope is to be able to scale these technologies and the methodologies that we have developed for this country that the government are using at local level, at national level, we scale it broadly. For instance, within South Africa, what we have developed in South Africa for air quality monitoring, we're gonna scale it across the country and there are conversations for us to scale this in Ghana, taking knowledge from South Africa and bring to Ghana. And that's why we meet every other week so that people know what is happening in other countries and the government in one country can be able to learn from that country scale these innovations that we have developed with communities and government and ensure that we make the data that these technologies can collect, that communities have been collecting, actionable for policies at each local level.